Good morning, everybody. Welcome to something a little bit out of the blue. Something different. I have decided to do a Nuzlocke. I don't know what brought it on me. I think I went down like a YouTube poll one day of uh, people doing it. I was like, mm, that seems fun. So I figured I'd do it, but I didn't know the best way to present it, if I wanted to at all even when I first started doing it, because there's a lot of grinding and downtime, I guess, and it doesn't seem as engaging. So my solution is just to show you guys the Elite Four. Sound cool? Cool. This is technically my first one under the hardcore rule set, which is basically can't use items in battle, uh, and Pokemon cannot be trained past the strongest Pokemon that the en the gym leader or the Elite Four has. So I got everyone up to level 60, which is the level of Lance's Dragonite. Not the champion, I, I think the rules are either Elite Four or champion, but I chose Elite Four. Everyone is 60. Can't use items in battle, held items are fine. And everyone's this level. Other rules apply. You have to use the set command in battle, like you can't do free switches, that kind of thing. And if Pokemon die, they die. Had to nickname them all. So we're gonna run through the Elite Four. Here is the squad. We have Knuckles, the female Sand Slash. Pretty strong, pretty bulky, kind of fast, surprisingly fast. Uh, brick Break, Dig, Earthquake, Rock Slide, just good damage all around coverage. Uh, she has leftovers on her, because she's bulky, don't exactly know what to put on her. Also me, the slow bro. Uh, there was a, there was originally a me that was a Snorlax, but I uh, uh, kind of ran into some issues while grinding on the way to the but, 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 uh, Neither here nor there. <laughs> bulky, big bulky friend that I never use too often. I, I kind of love this thing. Uh, it's got good all around, good tanky, good HP, good physical and special. It's just slow, but I think it can, which is why I give it the leftovers. It's just gonna kind of be there to tank hits and give them out. Ice Beam, Psychic, Psychic Amnesia, Surf. I figure with Amnesia, some of the uh, Elite Four I can set up on if need be. Uh, tag team that with leftovers, and hopefully he should be good to go. She should be good to go. Whatever. Bra, ab, my abra turn into a cadabra. Unfortunately, don't have anyone to trade with, so it's kind of stuck as a cadabra. Still fast. Still pretty good. Psychic Recovery, Combine Shockwave. Uh, Combine Recovery, gonna be able to set up on people a lot easier, and I'll be able to heal it back, hopefully. I think I have a, yeah, a Persian Berry, because there's some people that like to abuse some Confuse Rays, and that would be nice not to get confused by if need be. Yo, yo, yo! The replacement of me, the Snorlax, who might have died during the training. Fast and strong is a good bird. I like this bird a lot. Dodrio is one of my favorite of the original between Pidgeot, uh, Firo, and this thing. I, I kind of I like this goofball. Drill pack, agility, fly, try attack. Just going to hit hard. And hopefully, just honestly, it's kind of a glass cannon. Uh, a couple of these are. You are... These two are bulky, glass cannon, glass cannon, but physical. And speaking of other glass cannon, Larry Cable, Hitmonlee. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why the names I have. I, yeah, yeah, I look at that special defense. It's really good. Golly, that's surprising. But Brick Break, Endure re Reversal, just, you know, if you want to do that type of uh, setup, he doesn't really have too much going for him. And he has strength to hit psychic people for neutral damage, which. There's one particular Alakazam waiting for me in the wings, which will be scary, because I don't know if I outspeed it. Oh, whoopsie. One last person. This one I'm very proud of. Tracy. The Jolteon. Tracy's a friend. Uh, one of their favorite Pokemon's Eevee, so I figured that was cute. Uh, I 
may have EV trained this one in speed and special attack, so it is going to hit hard and probably pop like a popsicle if it die if it gets hit once. Though pretty good special defense. Also Volt Absorb for whatever that's worth. Thunderbolt, agility, thunder wave, quick attack. Oh, there's actually something I forgot to do. Is that I can't keep quick attack and thunder wave. But they're both kind of tedious and superfluous because Diltans is there to hit. And this is also a just in case provision for one Alakazam in the background. So we're actually going to ditch Thunder Wave. Probably could have ditched Agility, honestly. But either way, we're going to put on Shadow Ball just just because Alakazam, high special defense, need to hit it for something physical. And that's it. That's the team. Oh, yeah, also, uh, Prism Berry on the Chill Town as well. But we are going to tackle Elite Four. <sighs> Welcome to Pokemon Me. I'm Lorelai of Elite Four. No one can best me when it comes to icy Pokemon. <gasps> I started with the wrong Pokemon. I started with the wrong Pokemon. I started with the wrong Pokemon. I started. I was supposed to start with Tracy! Who's in front? Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Okay. Well, high special defense should be good. Oh god, I'm glad I pulled up the stats on these things. What moves does this dugong have? Surf, Ice Beam, Hail, Safeguard. Uh, not bad, actually. Maybe I should just use this opportunity to set up with Alakazam, if that's the case. They're all special moves, so I don't... Fuck, I said Alakazam, it's Kadabra. Okay. Uh, f fuck off. Fuck off with that shit. I forgot to buy recovery items, too. Oh, I hope I have enough in there. Okay, cool. So we're actually going to just be able to recovery and then calm mind up and then probably just sweep our whole team. The first two I still don't see being like a major threat. Unless I get frozen, that's also a possibility. But uh, now I can safely calm mind. Although, unless he crits me again, then I just pop. Probably should play around a critical hit. Hail. Hail? Okay. Whatever, dude. Oh wow, that is that is a long animation. Oh, I'm gonna go for a second combine. I'm realizing I'm just playing, hoping that I don't get crit, which is probably a super duper bad idea. Okay, he's just being a dumbass. Okay, he's he's just like actually his brain is shut down. None of them have priority. Uh, could, you're probably good to go. But I want to get a third combine. Honestly, I should probably just go for six if he's going to be doing this. Then again, I don't want to risk another crit. Uh, hmm. Three combines. It probably kills everyone, except for that Jinx, but I don't think that's a problem as long as they recover up. Oh yeah, this okay, we should be fine. Three combine. We're just gonna annihilate her now. Oh yeah, I could have just used Shockwave. Probably a better option, considering it's water. Okay. I I I don't think that crit mattered. We're at plus three. I have experience share on <laughs> Knuckles. I thought it had leftovers. Am I losing my mind? Oh shit. This has got a kill? Okay, what does more? Shockwave has 60 power. Psychic has 80, but it has stab. Uh, but super effective puts it to 120. What is... 90, so 45. No, this does more. Okay, I should just continue to Psychic. Until we hit slow, bro, and then I hit that up. Because you're trying to body slam me, aren't you? Yeah, get him out of there. 
Oh no, I switched to Knuckles. I'm so stupid. No safeguard, and now we ju we just kind of psychic the. And now we waste my motherfucking time and my motherfucking psychics. I ain't got infinite of those. Okay, fine. All right, you're making me use shockwaves. That's good. It's all good. That was probably a good Pokemon to set up on. It had dive, spikes, hail, and protect. Uh, or at least recover on, golly. So you're gonna yawn me if I don't take you out immediately. I have to shockwave because you're part psychic, so you'd resist this. You're not even an ice type. What the fuck are you doing here? Bye bye. Okay, okay. I had nothing to worry about. That was a clean sweep. I mean, granted, Shockwave kills this thing, which I mean, Jinxes are pretty especially bulky, I think. Oh. oh, fuck. Oh, fuck off. Okay. That was, wow, that took three combines. Wow. Okay. I'm just gonna go for it. I don't think I have too much to lose. I don't think a double slap can kill me. And we just get Shockwave and win anyway. Easy! Okay, cool. That is a wonderful noise you made, Jinx. Jinx, don't even be this way! We have money that is no longer valuable to us. <laughs> Pretty good, kid. I hope I have healing items. I have four hyper potions. Uh, I have a, I have two max potions. Oh, I have full restores. Okay, I did buy them. My brain works sometimes. Uh, we'll save the full restores. We'll just use the hypers. Boom. Also, I'm probably gonna split this up into multiple parts, but I want to just do the first two because they're still pretty easy. Okay. So, next is gonna be Bruno rocking fighting types and two shitty onyxes. So I think also me should be the person to go fight them because he's pretty physically bulky and he can just uh, do, <laughs> he can just get it done. Hopefully he doesn't die because I really like him for later, for uh, the Elite Four, but I also have Alakazam in the back. The reason I'm not using him, I keep I said Alakazam again. The reason that Bruh isn't just going in is because I'm afraid that he can't kill Hitmonlee and the champ in one go. So I don't want to risk it. This looks powerful, because it's an earthquake, but it's from fucking Onyx. <laughs> ah, bye bye. Okay. Th thank you, Crit, that didn't matter. Alright. Alright, also me, you got it's time for you to put in work. Oh god, that is also an animation. Alright, let's see what's like. Sky Uppercut? <laughs> Who is this, this? Bitch! That did less than Onyx Earthquake, are you kidding me? Bye bye. Okay, okay. We're not out of the woods yet, though. He is packing on some heat, but we still have two hard hitters. And I expect some shenanigans with crits always to happen. Okay. Yeah. Okay, neutral mega kick. Good. That's fine. Oh my god, he eats it! He eats it so well. You're so good. Did I over prepare for this? Golly. Boom boom do the shake it shake it shake it shake it big boy shake it also me you got this this is it, it's a little sad honestly I didn't expect him to be this fucking Kalunga Gunga bulky all right now the big boy Machamp I don't think will go down in one psychic. Because he's pretty bulky. Pretty bulky on top of big damage. 
It, it looks like it doesn't have many moves that scare me, though. Bulk up, cross chop, scary face. Well, I guess scary face scares me, but you know what? He's- oh, shit, he's, he's setting up. Though, he only has Rock Tomb to hit me for neutral, so I don't think cross chop is much of a threat. Pretty close. Pretty close. I had a feeling it wouldn't do it in one, but still pretty good. Does that mean Kadabra would have just like fucked them up? Did I overthink this? I am like a couple levels higher at this point. Yeah, okay. Bruh, would have fucked them up. Golly. And just like that, we have two Elite Four members just completely, utterly obliterated in no time flat. Just taken out left and right. Golly. Kinda of figured that would happen. Didn't know it would go that quick. That's okay though. Pretty quick episode. We're gonna do probably Agatha and Lance in the next episodes. You like this random uh, break from all the Fire Emblem? Duh, tell me and I might do it in other games. I don't know. I'll see you guys for the next Elite Four. Bye bye.